for cheap, fast, and reliable coins. Make sure to head on over to my sponsor, buymadencoins.com. They got quick delivery, 24-7 support, and make sure to use code POOL at checkout for 20% off and an extra 10% coins at checkout. Hey, what is up, guys? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video. <clears throat> Ooh, my bad for that scratchiness. Now, I got a pretty good coin method for you guys today. I wasn't planning on doing one today because I didn't really have one. So, one of my boys, that dude, Brett, who I've been talking to a lot on Twitter, he had this he had this method that I saw him do. And I was, like, kind of skeptical about it at first. I was looking at it. I was like, is that really making money? So, I was like, I'll try it myself. So, it's this old set, an archive. And I wanted to try it out myself to see. Also, credit to that dude, Brett. So, if you guys don't know his channel, go check it out. Pretty awesome guy in the Mutt community. Now, over to Mutt Heroes. I was skeptical about it at first. I wasn't sure if I was going to do it or even post it. So it's just set right here. So it needs one alter ego player and you get three sidekicks, right? And they do sell. Proof proof for this, proof that they still sell is I actually just uh, sold one a little bit ago, actually. Hold up. I'll share it right now. Um, Malcolm Butler sold. So those sidekicks are still still selling, I guess you could say. Sorry, I tried a Coke and it's coming up. So anyways... Emmanuel Agba, Jack Doyle, and Jack Doyle. These are the three cards that I pulled out of that set. So, if you look up how much Agba goes for, 8K, right? Jack Doyle, 8K. Now, two Jack Doyles, 8K, so that's 24K, right? So, let's go back. I'll do it in person for you guys. So, that's 24K, and look how much it cost me. It only cost me 19K. Obviously, if you could if you snipe these cards even more, I didn't even snipe it. I just bought the first thing I saw. I just want to I just want to test it out real quick. So look, um, let's just buy the first one again. I'm not even gonna wait to snipe. You guys, you guys wait to snipe. I just want to show you guys what I'm talking about. So I got this Keenan Allen for 19k. So I gotta make back at least 19k to not lose money on the set. Now, what do I always say? The biggest, the best coin methods are the ones where you can't lose money on. So you get three out of this. I'm starting to think the pulls you get don't even really matter, to be honest, because they all go for about 8K. Steve McClendon, Ramon Foster, and Tyler Boyd. All right. So I need at least, these cards have to go for at least 6.5K each, just about, to not lose coins. Just about. That's, that's, that's kind of me including reduction, too. So if you go to newest, I've so far I've so far spent 38K total. So these cards have to all add up to past 38K. But let's look at the singular one here. So that's 8K for uh, McClendon. All right. So, I need another 10k about to make my money back. 9k for Maroon Foster. So, that is 17k. And then Tyler Boyd, that is 5k. So, that is 23k just about. So, 23k. Pretty good, pretty good. So, so far we made 23k and 24k. So, that is 47k. And I've only spent 38k. So, I've made about 10k so far in seconds. Literally. Like, that could have been done faster if I wasn't explaining it. So, let's go do another one. Let's try this again. So far, this is looking like... An, it's just... It's auto money making if you just do it. And I know people are going to be like, Oh, but... They're not selling right now. Well, yeah. I mean, they're not... Like, some cars don't sell right away. Like, these cars obviously aren't that popular. But... It might take... It could take, it could take a few hours. It could take a few minutes. It could take seconds. It could take a day. Or even a few days. But the thing is, is that when they do sell... You'll thank me for it. So, so far, this still looks pretty good. So, let's add the Alter Ego card in. Miles Garrett. Let's do another one. So, this is Laquan, Tre La Laquan Treadwell. We got Antoine Bethea and James White. Bethea actually might be going for a good amount because he just got the MVP card. Also, he's now a giant, so he's even better. So, his value goes up automatically. Sorry, I was thirsty. All right. Let's start with there. I'm pretty sure this guy goes for a good amount. 12K. So that's 12K. So far, I only, I only need 7K more. i going to make my money back. Laquan Treadwell goes for 9K. So that's 12, 9, 21. I already made my money back. And then James White goes for 5K. So it's about 27K. So I have 27K, 23K, 24K just about. I'm pretty sure somewhere around there. So that's 47K plus 27K. Is 54, 70, 74K. I'm sorry if I'm off by a little bit, but 74K. And this has cost me so far about eight. Let's see, 18, 38, 40, 50, 
about 58k and i made over about 77k so i'm almost up 20k that's pretty good just in, in less than a few minutes so if you did this over the course of like an hour you could probably make like 100k if it, but it wouldn't obviously sell right away now to prove to you guys that i'm not bsing anyone because people start people have been thinking that i'm trying to bs them here like i wouldn't post things that i didn't think worked because if i didn't i don't want i don't want backlash like that's only gonna hurt me so i'm definitely putting more effort into these by like opponent i'm gonna show you guys every last detail that no one thinks i'm trying to like screw them over so if you go over to where is it i haven't looked for these in a while mud heroes and then we go so these 82s some of these go for 5k so worst possible pack right the worst possible pack you get like ethan westbrook tyler boyd ethan westbrook again yeah. worst possible pack you can sell these at night for about 6k each let's just say you sell them for 5.5 that's 15 that's 16.5k and I honestly, the odds of that are so low that you get three of the only three that like go for 5k. The odds are almost impossible. Very, very low. So if you did get the worst pack, you don't lose a K. But like mm, anything other than that, it seems like a really good profit at this point. Cause like th there's just there's just no risk involved with the set. Like worst, let's say worst, worst case is you have to undercut them a good amount and you make your money back. But like from what I'm seeing right now, from what I'm seeing, is that I'm making a lot of coins. It appears to be that way. I don't want to guarantee it right now because I know every time I say the word, I guarantee you, I get some backlash about that. But I, I'm no, 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 I can guarantee this one. I think I, I can put the stamp of approval on this one. Uh, hopefully, maybe I can see the sell on camera so you guys could believe what I'm saying. Twelve point two five, Steve McLendon. Eight point. I'll put him up for eight point four, and then should I go do one more? I should do one more, right? One more to show you guys that I'm not BSing anyone. That this this might be amazing to do. Now the only concern with what I'm doing right now is that when I post this, it'll probably get a good amount of views and then it could get saturated. So if you're watching this, I recommend you do it fast because if it is good and people people like it and I get a lot of views, there's a pretty good chance that this will go down uh, quite a bit once people get onto this. So. The earlier you're on this, probably the better, you know, like anything in life for the most part. So I'll do one more Michael Brockers and let's see if I can get more profit real quick. Okay, so quickly, I just realized that I could be doing this right here. So like if you look at the Thea, the team, uh, the Mud Hero one, I didn't realize I could just show you guys if I could just check if they've so they're selling a Mud Head right here to prices. You scroll down within the last 24 hours, there's been quite a few that have sold so yeah this does work they do sell confirmed it might take hours it could take a day but they do so if you got the expendable income go do it all right so i'm probably gonna put this in between somewhere in my video so it's gonna probably seem weird that i'm cutting to this and i'm cutting back to the regular thing but this is just so you guys are uh, i affirm it in the middle of the video so that's it stamp approvals on this go out and make some coins want an auction i thought my thing sold all right let's toss this in real quick Okay, three more. And we get... Give us some of the really expensive ones. Robert Quinn. I forgot about that guy. I haven't heard of that guy in a while. Travis Benjamin and Corey Lindsay. I think I just botched that so bad. I don't even know. I, I, just, I just read Corey Lindsay, but I think that was wrong. I'll tell you guys these prices real quick. And if they also go for a good amount, then I'm going to have to say go do it right now. Okay, Robert Quinn goes for... 7k so i'm at 7k gotta get back about 19k oh what's cory uh cory lindsley okay 9k about 10 so i'll go for 9.5 so 9.5 plus 7 is like about 16.5 so i need about 3k left so i already made profit on this one again travis benjamin can go for 5k and i'll be fine he goes for seven this is like instant profit at this point the only thing i can see is like though it's my take they'll probably take a while to sell but that's about it other than that, these these look like a pretty good set in my opinion. Definitely one of the better ones that I've I've put onto this channel probably, because once these do sell, there's literally minimal, minimal minimal risk if any. I'm just gonna check if there's any sets where these players are usable so that at least they'll have a they'll probably sell a little quicker for you guys. So the Mud Heroes, let's see, probably sidekicks to alter ego five sidekicks all three go now that's that wouldn't even make sense for people sidekick exchange for nat sidekick 
It's not bad if you have to do the sets. You toss it into the sets, right? Three sidekicks. It's not bad. Not that I want any mud heroes. All right, so that's about it, guys. So I'm going to be selling these cards and once they sell and I see it. I'll probably post this video up around then. So make sure to comment, like, and subscribe. Also, go to the Q&A video and go drop some questions so that I have some interesting questions to be going over. I have quite, quite a few already at this point, but just do it anyways. Also, comment down below 20K for a chance to win 20K. And I'll be doing that probably after the Q&A video. I'll reveal that. So that's about it, guys. I'm out. See you guys later.